Once in a while, I enjoy a trip to McDonald's. I guess because somewhere along the line, I decided that our time on this earth is too long and I needed to shorten my lifespan a little. But of course, enjoyed in moderation and as part of a healthy lifestyle that includes exercise and a half decent diet, it's really not that bad for you. There, now I can't be super slander. Anyway, I'm sure you've noticed if you've been to a McDonald's in the last few months, many of their restaurants have undergone major renovations and menu changes to make them seem less like some burger joint with a clown mascot and more like a warm, inviting environment where you'd want to sit and have a coffee, read the paper, and work on your self-published novel that'll never sell more than eight copies, assuming you have at least ten relatives. At different times of the day, usually late evening and in the morning, they refer to themselves as McCafe, and they'll say things like, Welcome to McCafe. Can I interest you in one of our bullshit McCafe iced caramel vanilla mocha latte chococinos? No, you absolutely can't. I came here for one reason and one reason only. A fucking greasy burger that I imagine is what God's shit would taste like. Delicious, but still wrong to eat. But for some reason, they want to compete with places like Starbucks. Why? Who thinks, hey, I'd like to go sit and have a coffee and chat with a friend. Let's go to McDonald's. No one. Obviously, they'd like to change that, but I can't see how that's possible. Starbucks is the type of place middle class and upper middle class dipshits go to have a coffee, read the paper, and work on that self-published novel no one will ever read. It's also a place where people go on a first date to get to know each other. If you take a girl to McDonald's on a date, I'll spoil the end of that date for you. Your dick is staying in your pants. McDonald's is the place you go when you don't feel like cooking, forgot to take something out for dinner, or when you want to go and get something to eat but you have shitty annoying kids, and you're responsible enough not to take them somewhere nice where you'll annoy decent people who are smart enough not to have kids that just want to enjoy their night out in a place where your food isn't served to you on a plastic tray. If you were playing a word association game and you said McDonald's, there's no one on the planet right now that's going to say great lattes. And like I said, obviously, they'd like to change that. And I'm sure they'll sell a shitload of coffee. It's the law of averages. If 50 million people walk into a McDonald's somewhere on this earth every day, and even 1% of them buy a coffee, that's a lot of fucking coffee being sold in a day. And adding anything to the menu can only mean increased revenues for McDonald's. But McDonald's, don't sell out to the hipster and BMW crowd. Remember the not-so-little people that got you where you are now. The people that sweat when they eat and are happy you don't have any stairs. The people who want a meal they don't have to cook for under $4 and the people who aren't educated enough to know that eating fast food daily will potentially give them diabetes. That's your bread and butter, and they don't want a coffee, a muffin, or a salad. They want a burger, fries, and an apple pie that may or may not contain some apple in there somewhere.